Okay, sorry about that. Right, some different sorts of police have arrived, so I've come back to live streaming. Apologies about the last one, I did lose the plot, sorry. Someone handed me a megaphone and that was it. I was so angry because the orange um, security guards were in here. And when they were in here with the protectors after yesterday's behaviour by them, so unprofessional and dangerous, they weren't stopped by the police when they assaulted protectors. So seeing them in there and seeing the protectors vulnerable in the position they're in. So seeing the protectors vulnerable made me very upset. Um, since then, uh, someone who was losing their temper less than I was. Someone who was losing their temper less than I was has spoken to um, someone in the police and had the orange security guards removed because they are dangerous, they're unpredictable, they're clearly untrained and unprofessional and not worthy of holding a badge for security because what they did yesterday was disgusting. And this morning too, one of our protectors has a boot mark on his face. Yesterday's one, they had him in a throat hold that was designed to cut his breathing. I'm going to stay here because these cops turned up that are wearing black and I'm never quite sure when they change different sorts of policing. There were six locked on, uh, front, inside and outside and back of the car. Uh, three of... Yeah, I think so. <laughs> what a shame. It is bizarre why they've left this. Oh, it's absolutely pathetic. Yeah. Might be because we went crazy. Because How are you they... doing that? I remember on Monday he was in for a long time. Yeah. That time did they... Yeah, yeah, I was only... I weren't impressed in long. I was in and out for an hour. That's good. Those, those cells are loads better than Blackpool. So you all OK? Yep, everyone's fine. Everyone's fine and handy. Yeah, so they had the... Um, the orange team were in there, they started blacking up this area and I totally lost the whole thing. Yeah, so the orange, orange shouldn't be outside of their work area anyway. So I took myself off live stream because I was being bad and then yeah. I gave it up. Then Ange came over and spoke to the police and said, we feel are yeah. agitated and getting angry by the minute yeah. because you've got them trapped. How do they feel in yeah. a vulnerable position yeah. with the orange yeah. team in there? Yeah. Yeah, the orange guys Just are not professional. Yeah. Just intimidation. It's not an extent to the police Especially force. when they've already proved how violent they are over the last couple of nights. Yeah, absolutely. Coming out of their work area to fight. Right, so the guys in black are... I don't know what they're doing. Frank, can I make this bottle of water or tower? Yeah, I need water badly. Oh, thank you, sweetheart. Oh, much appreciated. Thank you. Right, so Dominic. Um... Oh, you know, a bit stressy. Mm. They had the orange guys in there with them and they've just moved them out of the way because everyone was getting so angry, you know. <laughs> They're so vulnerable. People are still locked on. The orange guys have proved you know, how dangerous they are. And how professional. Two. But they've arrested three. Did you only roll one, Doug? Yeah. They should have helped. Stuff, stuff. <laughs> are you being aggressive? You'll get arrested. <laughs> My water, not yours. Hey, Bobby. Down at Florida. Having your friend. Well, the petrol tank's empty. Before they start using their stuff. They're locked in through it as well. Yeah. So, the scene today, if you're just joining us at Preston New Road, we've uh, today we've had a six person lock on all done around one um, vehicle. So there were two at the front, two at the back, two inside. Three have been cut off and arrested already and taken to Preston and Blackpool police stations. Currently there are still three left uh, locked on, I believe. The difficulty with this one is that they're locked on through the petrol tank so the person on the inside is, uh, is attached to the person on the outside through the petrol tank. 
working with nothing if not creative. Um, some stress and tension early, and certainly I vocalized it because I lost my temper. I try not to, but you know, police are very provocative. They laugh, they sneer. They're often not doing what, you know, like I used to work in nightclubs and when there was stress and tension, you used to do everything you could to make everybody feel like they were being respected and listened to in order to keep the calm and keep the peace. And I would have thought that would have been the basic requirement of a professional police officer. We're not paid, so we can lose our tempers. We're in a stress situation, but... Just give me a little bit. You can't leave He's right. a go. And, uh, but the police do everything they can to provoke us, which is absurd, really. Solid answer. Anyway, so earlier on, because of the stress and tension caused by yesterday's aggression and attacks by the security guards on our protectors, um, we saw them in here, this side of the fence, with those who were locked on, and then suddenly this black screening started to go up, and the black screening's up on the other side, if you can see as well, and we were very fearful at that point that all viewing and vision would be blocked and if they blocked our vision we couldn't be certain that our protectors would be safe or what would occur in there when we know that yesterday when the orange security guards attacked our protectors the police did nothing they stood by you know, police are constantly telling us that they have no bias they're not here for quadrilla or for us they're here for everybody to maintain safety on this road and yesterday puts cry uh, the pay to that because if that was the case they wouldn't have allowed <laughs> one protector to have his arm broken uh, for uh, another protector to be dragged by her hair and for them to stand on the fingers of the protectors <laughs> and to watch as Neil the, well we thought he was head of site security but now we're not sure he, now we found out he's got himself a security badge 